there is approximately 1.1% of the population who suffer from bipolar disorder, also formerly known as manic depression. This percentage equates to 51 million people worldwide. Just like the name suggests, bi meaning two and polar meaning opposite, which is what the person experiences, a cycle of depression being one and the other a manic episode. So what does a cycle of depression consist of? Well, a depressive cycle can lead to a person feeling hopeless, lack energy and focus. They can either eat and sleep too much or too little, with even thoughts of suicide being common. The person is also exposed to the other side of the mental illness, which is a manic episode. This is an intense episode which can have the person thinking and feeling that they are indestructible, many believing that they are on a mission from God or have supernatural powers. If untreated, this can often lead to the person being put in a dangerous situation. There are three types of bipolar disorder. Type 1 has extreme highs and lows, with episodes of mania lasting up to 3 to 6 months. Type 2 has similar lows but a smaller high called hypomania, which can last from weeks up to months. Type 3 is called cyclothemia or cyclothymic disorder. They have mild highs and lows. The person constantly cycles between the two, which can last for years. Like many mental illnesses, there is no clear understanding as to why we can have bipolar. Genetics and environment do play a big part. In fact, studies of identical twins has shown that if one has bipolar disorder, the other has 60-80% to 80 chance of developing it too. People with bipolar have an elevated level of dopamine, coupled with numerous neuron pathways cross-linking and firing simultaneously, creating abnormal thoughts and behaviours, in extreme cases causing delusional thoughts, paranoia and hallucinations. There is no cure for bipolar disorder. However, the treatment available is critical for the person's health and well-being. Medication like lithium can help stabilise mood and reduce the highs and lows the person experiences. However, lithium is mainly helpful for manic episodes and so is coupled with other medications such as antipsychotics. Although medication can be helpful, many patients are reluctant to take medication as it affects their personal life, making them feel sluggish and robotic, with many expressing that they lose their creativity. Modern psychiatry such as talk therapy is now frequently being used. Although the treatment is not helpful during a manic episode, it can be very helpful after or to prevent it taking place. The combination of treatments can be very helpful, however, understanding and support from family and friends is also key as it can have a major impact on how a person lives with bipolar disorder. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe.